now. Two pipes, two chill water pipes, supply and return coming from the building. Okay. Now you can see. Mm -hmm. It's getting up, getting up, getting up, getting up, getting up. Okay. And okay. Supply return. Okay. One pipe going up. Okay. The other pipe, it's a bypass one. Okay. This is the return line. Okay. This is the return line. You can see. It's just a air vent. And that's an air vent. It's a gate valve for flushing out something for this. Then a butterfly valve, a strainer, and this is just a support. And you can see a test point. That's a temperature, pressure gauge, and that's a drain point. That's a flange. Okay. That's a flange coupling. A reducer to the pump. This is 100 mm, this is 80 mm. So it's a reducer. So that's a pump. Okay. Now the two isolators connected. There's a power socket and it's an inertial pump so this is inlet line and this is discharge line very clearly this is discharge line okay so let me show you the discharge line okay this is a discharge line again a flexible connector this is this is also a flange and a flexible connector you can say okay now this is outlet discharge line you can see it's also a non-return valve okay now as you can see, it's uh, that's a DRV. That's a DRV, okay? Double regulating valve. Okay, it's having a memory stop feature, and now that's that's the line going to the chiller. Okay, there are three typical pumps. You can see three typical pumps. All three typical pumps. Just look for this complete one. That's supply line. I mean return line. It will be going. That's a discharge line, it will be going just like that. Uh, that will be going to the chiller, you can see. It's going, discharge line is going directly to the chiller. And from the chiller, after cooling, it will be coming to the building service. Okay, now there's a bypass line. And uh, here is a, is a, you know, it's a motorized valve. It's a motorized valve, motorized butterfly valve, which will be connected to the BMS. And this is a bypass line, okay. So that's just a bypass line, it's a motorized DRV. Uh, okay, now this is very simple now, but the complicated part comes here. Now this is a chemical dosing unit and it's tank full of chemical. Okay. Now this is a chemical dosing unit. And you can see there are two connections. Okay, one supply, one return line. Okay. Now one connection you can see is to the, the return line. Okay the return line you can see the return line and one connection you can see from uh, sorry this this is just focus on chemical dosing this coming one to the chemical dosing part the other one to the other end to this one supply and return both so it will be injecting chemical into the system in order to avoid corrosion and for better performance the other part over here is a pressurization unit we are having no less than primary pump and pressurization unit there is no secondary pump in the project. So this is a pressurization unit. You can see the two lines coming out, coming out, coming out, coming out. This is a water supply line. It will be coming from the booster pump. I can show you. It's going directly to the booster pump. That's a booster pump. So it will be connecting just like that one. And it will be going into the pressurization unit. And from the pressurization unit, it will pressurize the system. And it will discharge into this line. And you can see, you can follow my fingertip. And you can see it's connected in the return line of the chill water pumps, okay? which is coming from the building okay this is the main this is the header line and these are the sub branches one two and three sub branches okay so this is the cycle for the pressurization unit for the chemical dosing unit i can show you in the uh, drawings and manuals as well uh, as in the previous log i have said about chill water pump oh, sorry fire fighting pumps so these are chill water pumps that's a chemical dosing unit that's a with the hopper you can see and that one at the end is a pressurization unit and that's the panel for firefighting electrical and diesel pump respectively that's a control panel this over here is a typical booster pump uh, which will be boosting water to the building you can see a, a line from the tank water tank it will be coming just like that to the booster pump there are two typical booster pumps over here two pump set one control panel one pressure tank uh, which is 100 less capacity and 7.1 liter per second and it will just pressurize up to three bars and you can see 
strainer it's a flexible connector and uh, you can see it will pump out and this is the discharge line that's an inner line and this is the discharge line you can see pressure gauges and it will go directly into the building just you can follow it one one it will be going to the pressurization unit as explained earlier and one will be going directly you can see to the building to the building okay so that completes chill water and for fighting and the chill water simultaneously for the pump room thank you